In this video, I'm going to be showing you the outcome of using School Data Sync into Microsoft Teams. Also explaining how School Data Sync works with CSV files. And then I will show you the four step process we follow to create the automation of classes in Microsoft Teams. What you can see here is the School Data Sync lifecycle. We can see on the left all the student and teacher class information. On the, in the middle, you can see the automatic class creation and management using the data Azure Active Directory uses classes and schools, which feeds into Microsoft Teams, OneNote, Office and Microsoft Intune. The next number of pages you'll go through will be the outcome we're hoping to get. Here you can see the SDS classes created in Microsoft Teams, Algebra 1, Period 1, looks fantastic. Then you can also del deep delve into the sync class rosters, as you can see, the owners and the members, which will be the teachers and the students. The creation of the OneNote class notebook within the channel, the general channel of the team. As you can see here, this is the three steps you need for the school data sync to Microsoft Teams lifecycle using CSV. Step one is importing the CSV files from your learning management system. For us, it's either Edval or Compass. Then moving along to the SDS profile creation, and that's where you create your classes and also do the automatic class creation within that. And then step three is once the classes are now created, you can actually go in there and activate the teams for your students to jump into.